I'm Dr. Sanjay Janeja. I'm a hematologist and medical oncologist and also known as the Onc Doc. And my hope is to help guide you through cancer and all the processes that are involved, whether you're the patient or uh, a family member. It always helps to be knowledgeable about these things because it's much less intimidating. So what makes cancer challenging is that a cancer cell is actually more or less one of your regular cells and something went bad in its production. When you have regular cells, they're told with a switch to go ahead and replicate and keep growing. And they're also told to, hey, shut down. It's time uh, to end because you're too old or because you have too many problems in your DNA or basically your coding. When some of those switches go bad, that's when a regular cell has now become a cancer cell. So the switch that says replicate is stuck on, on the on switch and that's not good. So the, the regular cell now keeps growing. It's become a cancer because it is unregulated and keeps replicating. Or the button that says, okay, time to blow up. There's something wrong with kind of your characteristics. We're not happy about this. You're hitting the switch and the, nothing happens to the cell. So it's more or less just like a regular cell, a breast cell, uh, a lung cancer cell that has thousands of other things, proteins and characteristics and parts, just like your regular cells, but a switch got stuck or doesn't work anymore. That's also why we biopsy places to see what kind of cancer it is. With a biopsy, we can say, oh yeah, this is lung cancer, but it's a more aggressive kind. And that's because it's not blowing up when it's supposed to, or it's growing way faster than it should. For that reason, it makes it very challenging to basically kill a cancer cell, right? With therapy, how do you attack something that's more or less a regular cell, but just has one or two or three you know, switches that are also the switches that your regular cells have, but in a different position. The best way in general for almost all cancers is to just take it out. So in your whole lung, if you, if you smoke and then one part of your lung is where these regular cells have had enough bad mutations to become cancerous and they start populating, if you can take that whole lobe out of the lung, you're golden because then you've removed all those bad cells and they're just out. That's why surgery is generally the best curative option if it's an option for most cancers that are small enough and early enough. We'll talk in another video why sometimes you can't cut it out. Stay tuned for that. But again, my name is Dr. Sanjay Janeja, and let me know in the comments if this is something that makes sense to you, and we'll get back together soon.